Hey, it's Courtney Sosnick with ClickItUpANotch.com and I wanted to show you how I organize my photos on a Mac. So if you pull up your, go to your finder, which is also this guy right here, then I save all my photos on my external hard drive. So I'm going to create a folder. So click on the little um, cogwheel looking guy and say new folder. And then I title mine by year, so 2014. I'm just going to call it one because I already have a 2014 um, folder right here that I started, but for the purpose of this video. Then within this folder, I'm going to create a new folder for each month. I put a one or a number in front of the month because I want them to show up in, or in the correct order of the month, not alphabetical order like it wants to do. So I go through and I do this for each month. Then when I upload my pictures into Lightroom, and I have another video on that I will leave a link for, I am able to find my folder, as you can see here, my 2014. Obviously I still need to go through and do the rest of the months. And then I can go, you can see once I upload them into Lightroom, then I put them by the date and I give a little description of what it is. So I know that this was taken on January 1st and it was at the Frozen movie. So I like to have just a little description of what's in the thing because honestly I don't remember. Here's an example of 2013. <clears throat> so you can see all of my months. I can go back to May. I can see the photos that they were uploaded on that day. I pick the day I'm uploading the photos. If So if there's... As you can see here, the 5th, or on May 7th to May 14th, I didn't upload any pictures, so I just picked that day. So you can just put little descriptions, like on May 26th, you know, um, or May 20, 25th was Claire's birthday, the 27th was New York City. Um, so these are just little descriptions, so when I'm going back to try and find those pictures, and I can't remember what day it was taken, obviously birthdays are different, um, but just something you know, Kate riding her bike. I don't, I won't remember in two years what day that was. <laughs> so these are just the way I break it down. I do not rename my images once I upload them, but I do export them into folders for print and web. I printed some of these. So I, again, I put a number in front so it shows up at top. And then I have those images sized for print. And again, that's in another video of how I export them from Lightroom. So hopefully that helps you organize your photos and be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks.